On a December morning in 1903, Wilbur Wright watched his brother Orville fly their homemade airplane for 12 seconds, making it 36 meters. By the end of the day, they'd made it 259 meters, becoming the first humans to achieve powered flight and setting the scene for the future of aviation in our skies and beyond. But Wilbur's future was cut short just nine years after that inaugural flight because he lived in the past in a time before antibiotics, when a simple infection like typhoid could kill a healthy adult like Wilbur in just a few days. But the past is threatening to repeat itself. Bacteria are constantly evolving, yet our arsenal of antibiotics is dwindling fast, and there's been very little investment in finding new ones which is why the World Health Organization listed antimicrobial resistance as a top 10 global threat to humanity. And today, bacterial antimicrobial resistance causes 1.27 million deaths every year. That number could rise to 10 million by 2050, leading to 28 million people living in poverty and $1 trillion additional healthcare costs. But the most vulnerable are at greatest risk. We have to tackle antimicrobial resistance head on and reverse the threat through relevant use of antibiotics and antimicrobial stewardship. It's time for solutions that decisively fight antimicrobial resistance. By boosting the development pipeline, and securing sustainable access to novel antibiotics. Getting new treatments to the patients who need them most. Put the future in focus by fighting antimicrobial resistance together. Get started today at infectioninfocus.com.